Sabres hosting the Rangers, and the Rangers are minus 125. On the money line, the Sabres are plus 104. The over-under is at six and a half goals. The Rangers, laying a goal and a half on the puck line, are plus 184, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win this game by two goals or more. And the Sabres getting a goal and a half on the puck line are minus 225, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. Thank you for everyone who has joined the Discord. If you've not done so yet, go to my website, rossportstalk.com. Click on the Memberships tab. It is a paid membership, but you will have access to the best bets. Win, lose, or draw, you will see how I do. Head-to-head, the home team is 6-4. and four. The Sabres are on a two-game winning streak against the Rangers, although the Rangers are 7-3 and three in their last 10 meetings against the Sabres. The underdog has won the last two games they played against each other. The favorite is 7-3 and three on the money line, while the underdog getting a goal and a half on the puck line is 8-2. and two. There have been eight one-goal games in their last 10 meetings, including the last six games that they played against each other and the last four games that they played against each other went into overtime. The under has hit in their last three games. The under is seven and three, and the under six and a half goals is seven and three. The last four games that they played that went into overtime, the Sabres won three to two in a shootout. The Sabres won three to two in overtime. The Rangers won two to one in overtime. The Rangers won five to four in overtime. Now, what will we expect to see? I know it's supposed to be Shesterskin versus Levi in net. And the Rangers are supposed to be an improving team while Buffalo is supposed to be rebuilding. But seemingly, Buffalo has been playing the Rangers well. I'm going to take the Sabres with the money line. I'm going to take the Sabres getting the goals, and I'm going to go under in this game. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut, and please bet responsibly.